Welcome to another edition of the Sundown Series, where we have now entered into another state, Ohio. Now, this state actually holds a lot of weight for my channel because this is pretty much what kicked off a good portion of my channel when it came to talk about that opioid play because I've always said that Ohio is the hub for heroin. And here we are finally in the state of Ohio. And the first place we're going to talk about is Fairborn, Ohio. I feel like I heard of this place before. Fairborn is a city in Greene County, Ohio, United States. The population was 32,770 at the 2010 census. Fairborn is a part of the Dayton Metropolitan Statistical Area. It is the city in the world named Fairborn, a portmanteau created from the names Fairfield and Osborne. After the Great Dayton Flood of 1913, the region and state created a con con conservation district here and in the 1920s began building Huffman Dam to control the Mad River. Residents of Osborne were moved with the houses to an area alongside Fairfield. In 1950, the two villages merged into the new city known as Fairborn. The area of the village of Fairfield was settled by European Americans before Ohio was admitted as a state. The first log cabin was built in 1799 by George Greener. Pioneers migrating northward and westward from Kentucky and Virginia considered this area near the Mad River desirable for settlement. They were encroaching on territory of the native Shawnee, who sometimes raided the village. Settlers retaliated. No massacres were recorded, but both sides engaged in taking prisoners. Until the mid-1960s, the city of Fairborn prohibited African Americans from living there and declared it, it was a sundown town. Officials at Wright Patterson Air Force Base are credited with working with the city residents to end such policies, especially as the United States military was integrated in the beginning of 1948. The population since 2010 has increased 3.4 percent from 32,770 to 33,876. The racial makeup of the town is 84.8% white, 7.7% African American, 0.3% Native American, 3.1% Asian, 0.1% Pacific Islander, 0.8% from other races, and 3.1% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino people of any race are 2.4% of the population. So the highest, I guess you could say, minority or non-white group in Fairborn are black people, but by just a very small margin. But I'm not surprised. But I feel like I've heard of Fairborn before. Or was at Dearborn. I can't. I get, I'm getting the Borns mixed up. But that pretty much concludes this edition of the Sundown series. Um, very short and you know pretty much to the point. Y'all, let me know if you've ever heard of Fairborn before. If is anybody in Ohio, can you explain to me or maybe go into more detail about how this town operates based on what I read or maybe some things that I missed. And I'll talk to you in the next one.